listen in the background, uh, you can hear the James Moore backing band. <laughs> um, Colin asked me here because um, I, uh, I'm a film writer uh, and I'm also a visual artist. And uh, at the moment it's grand season. So I figured I'd come here. I know some of you are creative, or you know creative people, uh, perhaps. So I just thought I'd come here and maybe give you a little run through of some ideas that I've had for um, urban art installations around Dublin or Ireland. Um, <coughs> idea one. Uh, now these are thinkers, just so you know. Uh, so I'll be here for about five minutes, uh, and that's five minutes of work. Yes. I don't want you to feel like you can relax. <laughs> idea one, uh, an obese tiger. Uh, it's okay. <laughs> With, uh, obese tiger. It's iron. It's a metaphor. Uh, for the carpet tiger. <laughs> uh, obese fat fat cat. <clears throat> Idea two. Uh, a picture of the Virgin Mary. Uh, have you? How many of that's nice? <laughs> and half of you are probably thinking, uh, ironic. <laughs> Idea three. Uh, this one. Uh, a statue of Seamus Heaney that cures alcoholism. <laughs> um, I sort of feel like you, you read the paper and there's Oh, oh, a lot of money went into this library, or this statue, or whatever. And what does it do? What do we get out of it? And this one cures alcoholism. Uh, I was talking at the board, and I said, oh, that's very... And I said, that's worth it. It's worth every penny. <clears throat> Idea four. It goes. Idea five. <laughs> uh, everyone votes on their favorite picture. And then you get an email the next morning and it has that picture. <laughs> I just sort of, it's a nice one. It's not as soft. Because uh, there are four hard topics. And you can do it now. You can do whatever you want. You can just sit there and think of your favorite picture. <coughs> Hello, my name is James Bourne. I'm an artist uh, as well as a film writer. It's grand season. Uh, Colin invited me here. So I have a number of pictures, uh, a number of art installations that might be good for this city we have built on the moon. Idea one. An isolated cat. Um, it's a metaphor for the moon. The moon is isolated. <coughs> Idea two. A uh, picture of Gandhi. I don't really know who that is. Uh, but he has some inspirational quotes. <laughs> the moon is isolated, uh, so it's good to be inspired. <laughs> Idea three. A statue of Buzz Aldrin that cures space madness. <laughs> uh, I read the paper and I hear a lot of people say, oh, we built a library, we built a space picture. 
What does it do? Space madness affects 90% of the space population. It would be great if we could get that under control. Idea four, a space ghost. Idea five, everyone votes on their favorite picture of the moon. And we get it in our Oculus Rifts. <laughs> Hello, my name is James Moore. I am an artist. Colin invited me here to talk about my art. It is grand season. Here are my ideas. I'm Mars. An insane cat. <laughs> Space madness is a very real issue, it affects 100% of the population. <laughs> An insane cat represents this. We are the same insane cats. Idea two. A group of scientists that try to stem the terrifying encroachment of space madness. I read a lot of the paper. You see, uh, oh, we built a library, we built a Mars thing. What does this do for us? We're all insane. <laughs> uh, so I think it'd be useful, is all I'm saying. <laughs> Idea three. A ghost. <laughs> Idea four. Everyone chooses their favorite picture that represents madness to them and perhaps soothes them. And these pictures are beamed into your consciousness through modern technology. 